Good morning, grade twos. Welcome back to our case of handwriting and the new pattern that we're doing this week. I'm so excited. Look at all the letters that we've learned. We've learned to write the A, the K, the E, the E, the N, the N, the N, the O, the A, the V, and the W. That's actually quite a lot. Now, to this week, we are going to learn the G, the J, and the Y. And from tomorrow, we'll start writing the letters. But we're going to have another day where we will just practice the patterns for now. All right. So please uh, join with me. Um, write the date, 16 June and Tuesday. And then we are going to do our finger exercises and eye exercises. So when you are ready, I am ready. Pause the video if you have to, if you need to do some catch up. So let's go with the, we'll start with the finger exercises and today we're going to do the one where we put our hands down, keep it down and lift just the pinkies. I know it's hard, keep the other fingers flat. And now the ring finger, lift it up high, good. And the tall finger. And the pointing finger. And there we see the thumb. And the thumb is actually quite easy to lift. Right. Let's do our thumb fights. Thumb fights. There we go. And this morning we'll do the lazy eight for the eye exercises. Put your elbow in your hand. And let's go around to the left, around to the right, around to the left, around to the right, round up, round up, around up, around up. Keep your eyes on the tip of your thumb. Do not move your head. That's it. Keep going, keep going, keep going. And now let's do the other with the other hand also. Let's go around, 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 around. And it's no good you doing these if you are not following with your eyes. Your eyes should religiously follow the tip of your thumb. Otherwise, these exercises actually do not mean much. Right, so there we go. Before we write the pencil grip again, we hold it correctly, we pinch it, we curl over, and then we crawl forward. You can see there's the thumb and the pointing finger on either side of the cokey, and this finger is curled up at the bottom. Good. So we're going to go up, space at the bottom, up, up. Up line and an up line. And now for the next one, we're going to practice our move to go forward. It's almost like a wheel of a car or a bicycle turning, turning, turning. It's actually quite a, a well known movement. So we go back around, back around, back around. We are practicing to call back. So do an entire line of that. Let's do another one of this where we practice curling back. Up, back, up, back, up, back, up, back, and away. Now we're going to do the one again where it looks like the E pattern but we're going to go straight down over two lines to practice for those um, tall letters going down. You remember I, I call them our fishing letters where they let their tails into the water. So let's go up, straight down, call back away. Straight down, call back away. Straight down, call back away. Straight down, go back away. And I'm going 
going to do another one of this for today. So it's up, straight down, over two lines, go back away. Down, go back away. Down, go back away. Down, go back away. Down, go back and away. And that is it for today.